Uh, well, I'm from Northumberland originally, a yeah. little town called Annick. Um, trained in Birmingham, went to uh, Birmingham School of Acting, and then I've been out in the industry for the past uh, 10 years, there or thereabouts. Mm -hmm. yeah, can't be 10 years. Am I that old? No, maybe like eight years. I don't know. Uh, for me, the big thing was when I got the script sent through or the sides when um, when I was auditioning, it was mainly just the kind of camaraderie and friendship between Dean, Bailey and Paul that, um, I don't know, I think it's quite similar to the way that I act with my friends and just things like that. I thought, you know, nice bit of, nice bit of crack, nice bit of banter, you know. <laughs> Yeah, so um, Dean is kind of like, back in school he would have been the leader of the group. He was maybe the, the slightly less nerdy, more charismatic one of the trio. Um, but he clearly just really has a good relationship with these, uh, with these two guys and that obviously is, is rock, his emotional core. So um, throughout, the D, uh, throughout the film, Dean mainly is kind of like bantering with Bailey, ripping into him, which is exactly how I talk to my friends. Uh, he's obviously there trying to support uh, Paul, who's holding this light here. Lovely <laughs> for us, that's why I keep looking up. Um, um, lovely extras as well. <laughs> yeah, I mean, so what got us into acting, it's quite a funny story actually, was um, uh, I was in sixth form and my girlfriend at the time was staying behind to audition for the school play and she was giving us a lift home and I couldn't be arsed walking so I just was like yeah I'll wait with you while you audition for this play and because I was just sat in the room wait, waiting the teacher uh, came over and was like do you just want to audition since you're here I was kind of bored so I was like um, yeah all right I'll give it a shot so he handed us the sides got us to stand up and read in and um, I think I think they were a bit short of blokes who were auditioning. So anyway, I got cast in Death of a Salesman by Arthur Miller, and um, I was kind of just like, I'm, I'm in a bloody play. Like I've never done this before in my life. Um, but yeah, just going through that experience and then and doing that was kind of what triggered it. But it was completely by coincidence. It was me being too lazy to walk home, which uh, kind of landed us in this position. I quite like um, someone like Robert Carlyle, you know, um, one of those kind of British actors. Um, I just think they always bring such a kind of like uh, intensity but realism and um, someone like that I think is wicked, yeah. Just want, would like to do something a bit raw like that, you know what I mean? He always plays absolute crazy people though, so maybe not the best to look up to. This is my special acting face, are you ready? <laughs> <laughs> 